Oh my goodness. <laughs> Welcome back to Ozarks Fox AM. Katrina Mirashnichenko. I was not even close. It was it's, a little bit close. Can you say your last name? It's Mirashnichenko. There you go. That's I right. could not say that to save my I life. I wrote it down uh, so that I could. Uh, it's, it's a hard one. How long did it take you to get used to that? Actually, that's your married name, right? Yes, that's my married name. So I actually I learned that actually really fast. Because um, I actually had a lot, a lot of Russian friends growing up. Oh, so okay. I okay. Can I ask you, what was your maiden name, though? Lisky. Lisky. Okay. okay. Well, still, it's there in that family, in yeah, the genre. Yeah, yes. Well, actually, Lisky, my actually, everyone thinks it's Polish, but it's actually German. Awesome. Oh. Well, welcome, and you look beautiful. And we want to know about what Miss International, the International Pageant is. You are Miss Missouri. Mrs. And, Mrs. Yes. Missouri. Yes. yes. Right. She is married. She's the married one. Uh, yes. International. Tell us about that. Okay. So the Mrs. International pageant is a program designed for married women and the wives of married women and mothers. Um, I was actually selected through a very comprehensive judging or international pageants committee through a very strict application and interview process. Okay. Um, and the pageant itself basically focuses on the achievements of married women and their community involvement. Nice. Oh. That's so great. That's also one thing I'm very proud to be part of because it mm -hmm. really works on involving us in the community. Mm -hmm. So I'm really honored to be wearing this title. That is wonderful. <laughs> right. um, what are some things you are involved in, in in the community? Okay, so as part of the pageant, um, I'm gonna. I want. I, I got my title late. I got it on April 29th of this year. A lot of the other contestants in the pageant mm -hmm. actually received it already in the fall. So I'm like way behind here. So I'm getting started on it. But I'm. My goal is to get into some of the community events. Like I'm gonna make an appearance at the Sertoma Duck Festival this weekend. Mm -hmm. um, I will oh, yeah. be on the show with Branson Bell Saturday. Nice. Because that will will be our seven-year wedding anniversary, actually, for me and my husband. Oh. Wonderful. Congratulations. And I have also been part of the Salvation... I've worked in the Salvation Army for volunteering and stuff, too. Mm -hmm. um, I do... I go to James River Church, which is one of the biggest churches here in mm -hmm. the Ozarks. Um, I do try and help out some of the events that they do. And they have a lot. Yes. I mean, this weekend, I, they're supposed to be doing the project for the community. Uh, I can't think of the name, but they're helping like public schools, like they're going to go into public schools and do like repainting, landscaping, oh, gardening. Right. Helping out. Yes. Community. And I, I would have done that. I was like, but I've got so much stuff this weekend because I've been getting ready for prepping. And then I work at horses as a hobby and that's kind of my oh, job. Right. Oh, so, wonderful. <laughs> yes. So it's really kind of. So do you, didn't, do you need to, you're Miss Missouri International. Yes. So if you go on to Mrs. International, is there another pageant coming up that you would then compete in to get another title? Um, well, I am competing in the Miss International pageant, which takes place mm -hmm. July. 15 through the 21st. It will also be live streamed. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. So I'll make sure I share the link. And so throughout my actual reign as Miss International mm -hmm. 2019, I'll be going all over the world to be doing public speaking on my platform, which is anti bullying. Why did you choose that? Okay, so I was actually bullied in high school throughout my whole high school. I switched schools four times. Wow. Yes. Yeah, I switched schools four times. And then actually, even as adults, I have a few friends. I mean, social media is a big yeah. problem that causes, uh, yeah. that assists mm -hmm. bullying because of cyberbullying. Yes. Yeah. And so um, not a lot of people even like talk about it. It's mm -hmm. there. But this is one thing the pageants, that's why they also chose me because they haven't had anyone really speak about bullying. Mm -hmm. So they really like the fact that I'm doing something different. It's really important. We, we touched on that today. Mm -hmm. I, so many kids are bullied through social media. That, it does a lot of good social media and a lot of bad. So I like that you've chosen that because people need to hear about that. Yes. I mean, I, the other thing, too, because I have two boys myself, and I don't want them to go through school the same way that I did if I can help it. Mm -hmm. And I know one of the problems that a lot of schools are ha having is they don't know how to handle the solution. Right, right. And so I want you, to, you know, I'm going to try go this year throughout and speak to so different schools on bullying and being against and anti-bullying, and then as well as family events, okay. because I figure family events are going to be more orientated because right. it's family related. Exactly. Mm -hmm. That'd be great. Well, that's all. I'm so happy to see you, and we're so excited yes. for and you. You're beautiful. Okay. And best of luck to yes, you. Best of luck I've, to you. Yes, I got the big competition next month, guys. <laughs> and be sure and share that link with us. I will. All right. Absolutely. All right. Thank you, all right. Katrina. Coming up in just a few, we're checking back in with the ladies on. This last day of the girlfriend getaway there at Silver Dollar City. Oh, Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Have that place. Yes. Jeremy wants to try that on. I know. I love it. It's so <laughs> shiny and sparkly. So pretty. I'm in it.